year that Buffalo set record breaking temperatures in March. The weather for opening day for the Buffalo Bisons is cold and wet. News 4's Lou Ragoose is live for you at Coca Cola Field where they are getting ready for some baseball. Lou, I see some players out there warming up, and they definitely need to do that today. Yeah, the field is uh, ready to go. Players are warming up, both uh, figuratively and literally here. Uh, even hitting some bombs out to us behind the right field fence here. And it is a little cold, but the Bisons want you to come out so much so that if you keep your ticket from today, you can use it to get into another game during this home stretch for free. It's a special year for the Buffalo Bisons, the 25th year the team has been playing at Coca-Cola Field. Hard to believe it's been almost a quarter of a century since we opened uh, the gates and we have a lot of uh, things planned all year. A season-long celebration looking back at the players, the events, the history that's taken place at this ballpark. And with the big anniversary comes another big day mid-season. The Bisons will host the AAA All-Star Game on July 11th. And you can pick up hats and shirts to commemorate both the All-Star Game and to mark 25 years at Coca-Cola Field. And new retro gear will be rolled out for the fans. Throughout the year, we'll be, uh, Bison's team will actually be wearing retro jerseys, jerseys from the past that they've worn here at the ballpark on various days. And, uh, of course, we'll sell some of that retro gear. Of course, you can't go to the game without having a hot dog or at least some sort of ballpark food. The Bisons are incorporating a lot of local food into this year's concessions. We have the official hot dog of the Bisons being Salem's Hot Dogs, a, a huge favorite in, in western New York. Charlie the Butcher's uh, beef on whack, can't go wrong there. There'll be a stand behind home plate named Charlie the Butcher's. Plus, pasta dishes served in the ballpark's restaurant Petty Bones with Ilio Di Paolo's marinara sauce and Wardinsky's sausage, not to mention local craft beers. And, of course, if you're planning to come out to today's home opener, just bundle up and the Bisons will reward you. We know it's less than ideal conditions, but if, you, if you're you know, brave enough, come out and support the Bisons, you get to come back and see another game. And it's a good week to come back. Not only is the weather getting better after today, but it's Kids Week, and that means you buy one ticket at the box office at regular price. You get two kids' tickets for free. Reporting live, Lou Ragus, News 4 at noon.